I'm giving... Okay, the playlist I said that was too much yes, on yesterday's stream, I'm giving it another chance. I just realized I didn't turn off the coffee maker. I... Okay, I remembered this time. I remembered this time to turn off the coffee maker. Okay, <laughs> we're good. What's up, bro? Good to have you on the stream, uh, Ryan the Cyan. I, I still can't read your name. I apologize. Um, anyway, so today we are going to... Um, like if you are on yesterday's stream, you remember that uh, Ryan... Not Ryan the Cyan, but Ryan Hudgens, um, also known as Orchestra, suggested that I um, learn a Mega Minx method called Omega. And I checked it out last night. A lot of the algorithms were pretty easy for me. Um, hang on. I don't know if this is the best angle, but yeah, it works, it works. But, um, oh, oh, we got really blurry for a second. But anyway, um, so a lot of the algorithms are just like, kind of like sledgehammer and like weird like sexy move type of things and then like to orient the edges and then after you solve that well i mean for at least for the beginner method of this you insert the corner and because like i know zz i know like a lot of different ways to do last corner to like preserve different things because like, i feel like that's a common thing in zz so th this part's really intuitive to me. The only part that isn't intuitive is uh, this part with the last three corner algorithms. And there's only 21 of them. So today, I'm gonna learn them today. I, I know this one though, except I, I did it from the wrong angle. This is how you do it. Okay. Uh, wait, no. I, I made a fool out of myself. I made such a fool out of myself. Uh, I, I apologize. I was like, I know how to do this algorithm, does it wrong. <laughs> okay, okay. Um, here, let me just post uh, real quick. I'm gonna, I, I need to uh, let people know I'm streaming. But yeah, that's what we're gonna do today. We're gonna learn the other 21 or the 20 something, 22, 23, I forget how many algorithms. And then we're gonna do some solves. Uh, oh crap, oh no, there, there's, there's flies again. Sorry. Um, okay. All right. So I'm gonna just real quick open up, uh, not that. I'm gonna open up the alg sheet that uh, Ryan provided me. Uh, it's this one, okay. And I know the first case already that's on the Allen sheet. It's literally just um, uh, like this is EBLL. Wait, well not that one, but not that one either. <laughs> I'm trying to like, okay, I'm doing the algorithm over and over again on three by three, but I want to like show you on Okay, so this is what the case looks like on a 3x3. Three three. It's when you have headlights going this way, corners are solved, and you just have this giant block with like nothing unsolved. Really, the case is just that you have these two corners twisted, but uh, it's a really easy case to solve. You just do anti-soon, YouTube, anti-back soon. And, that's, and that, it's the same case on Mega Minx. Uh, except you do that because what confuses me about Megaminx is the direction at which you do YouTube matters. I'm like not used to that. So you, so for this I do, this is the first case I need to learn, which I already know. I do that, YouTube, and then that. And then we solved it. Okay. Um, Next case looks like it's a bit harder. It, it looks like some kind of commutator, or if not a commutator, then like something. Um, I hope I didn't get like in front of the camera there. 
Um, okay. All right. So anyway, uh, what it looks like is like it, it looks like a three cycle that's like this or no, not like that, like this, except it doesn't. Like it looks like the corners are swapped in some other weird way. I've not like I don't think it's a possible case on a three. I apologize, that was a spam caller, again. Um, let me turn the music down a little bit. But this is, this is more of my kind of music, or yes, on occasion it is. Um, I don't think I'm vibing with it very much right now, but it's like, but it's like the music I listened to in high school, like all the time. Anyway, um, okay, so this algorithm is F prime R, U2 prime, R prime, U2, R prime, F, R, U2, R, U2, R prime. Wait, really? Wait, but that broke up so much. Okay, let's try that again. U2 prime, U2, and then, okay, so it's like a weird sledgehammer thing like with U2s in between. Okay. So it's not a commutator, but it is a three corner cycle in a different way. Or maybe it is a commutator, I can't tell. Wait, no, 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 it's U2 prime. That matters. Yeah, I don't, I don't know if this is much of a vibe actually. Okay, we, we gave we gave the playlist a second chance and it was not a good it was not good. Okay, let's. Uh, I'm just really I don't I don't want videos to be like flagged because the uh, music is, um, you know, I don't I don't want the mu I don't want the video to be flagged because of uh, copyright or anything like that. I don't want to keep playing this music though. I need better music. <laughs> anyway. Um, okay. So, next case. Uh, no. Okay. F prime, U2 prime, sledge ish thing, and then that. Okay, well, for now, okay, I'm just gonna solve uh, PLL again for now, or like, I'm, I'm gonna put the puzzle into a solved state so that way I, uh, so that way I could be certain of it being like solvable, I guess. Okay. Okay. F prime R U two. Wait, no, no, I did it the wrong way already. Oh, it's U two prime again. That's what I've been doing wrong. Okay. Or you know what? Hang on. Let's let's solve it like as you would in uh, Omega. So instead of solving PLL, I'm gonna pretend that this slot is empty. I'm gonna move that there and then do that. And now we have edges solved, so we skip to the edges and then insert that. And then we have this algorithm I've yet to learn. <laughs> okay, so let's just, No, this is what I wanted to do. And then let's just do like a weird A perm thing. Okay. Um, okay, let's try that again. Okay, F prime. And then, wait, is it really U2 prime? Yeah, it is. Oh, that's weird.
I'm not used to doing U2s one way all the time. But this algorithm is pretty easy. Except when I mess up like that. Oh boy. Okay, for now I'm just gonna do the method I'm used to. Okay, so that's that. Um, here, let me open up the chat real quick. Okay, so I'm alone right now. I, I guess like learning a method might not be the most riveting content, but I figured that's what I wanna do. I have a competition coming up and uh, it's, what's it called? I want to make sure I'm ready for the competition. I wanna make sure I'm gonna practice Mega Minx, I'm gonna practice four by four and like fully learn the two set method. I'm gonna practice, I might practice a little bit of six by six, except I'm just gonna do regular reduction on six by six. I, I, I thought about doing crazy things with six by six, but it's not, it doesn't, I don't think it really works. Um, what else? I'm gonna practice a lot more square one. I'm gonna practice a little bit of skew. I don't want to overdo skew because I know I'm going to hurt my wrist. I, I want to like be ready for the competition, but I also don't want to, um, yeah. Uh, what was I going to say? <coughs> Excuse me. I also want to make sure later on that my ZBLL is good. I learned all of 2GLL and TZBLL, but my TZBLL is kind of bad right now. So I'm probably gonna spend one day in the like upcoming month doing like train you and stuff. Okay. Anyway, uh, next case, or hang on, let, let me just do this a few more times to make sure I'm doing it right. Okay, I think I did it right that time. Yeah, 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 okay. Okay, easy, easy. Okay, um, this case, okay, this case is just, it looks like the same three by three case. Like, you know, um, yeah. Like it looks, it looks like this one, like, but the actual case this time. Although it looks like they don't give us that L, they give us a weird two gen solution. So maybe that might be better. So what they do, what they say is, they, okay, let me just get it to that first. Wait, hold on. Or maybe it's an entirely different L because here, here they have, that's so weird. Okay. Okay, so they have a starting with U2, and then R, U2, R, wait, no, R, U2, R2 prime, U prime, R2, U2, R, R prime, U2. Wow, that's, that's cool. That's cool, it's like a, a, like a two gen L for that, wow. <clears throat> Regroup thumb on bottom first, okay. Wait, no, that's R. Hang on, it was R, U2, R, U2 prime, R2 prime, U prime, R2, I know. Okay. R U two R U two R prime no no no. R two prime U prime R two U two No no R prime U two I think Yeah, 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 like that. That's a fun algorithm. 
if I if I didn't know any better, I would have done like the like this one. What does that actually look like on three by three? Wait. Okay, so it completely fucks up F2L. No wonder why no one uses it. I mean, okay, no one uses it because corner permutation doesn't work the same on a three by three. But still, I think it's I think it's kind of funny how how messed up it is on a three by three. <clears throat> Okay. Okay, here, hang on. Let's, uh, okay, let's try solving last layer again, like in Omega. Because, like, I kind of want to solve it the way I'm comfortable with doing, you know? Like, I, I, I'm comfortable solving last layer with, uh, wait, no, uh, I don't know what I was doing there, but I'm, I'm comfortable solving it like like normal, you know, like OLL PLL or like two look OLL, two look PLL rather. Cause I, I don't know, I don't know full OLL and PLL, <clears throat> full OLL and PLL on this puzzle, which is actually why I'm learning this method to begin with. But because I'm so deep into the habit of solving with um, OLL, P OLL, PLL, I keep wanting to solve it that way. Like, even though I'm learning a new method. So like, yeah. Okay, uh, Ryan or Orchestra or whatever said that he's gonna join the stream when he can. So I'm glad to hear it if you're watching this later. Not gonna lie, I, I mean, I personally hope I get more viewers after the stream, excuse me, after the stream and during the stream, because then that would mean if, if no one watched after, then I'd get five viewers and then nothing else. But anyway, um, okay, so we're doing, uh, oh, it's this algorithm. Okay, let's, um, Okay, first let's drill this one for a second, so I don't forget it. I don't know, like, I don't know the optimal finger tricks for an alg, for this alg. Uh, that was wrong. Okay, let's, let's fix this. Okay. Wait, no. Oh no, this is this case. And then... Oh, this is one of the ones we're learning, I think. Like, literally one of the ones I just learned. Which one is this? Wait, is it? No, I think this actually might be a different case. By the way, if you're wondering why I'm solving with yellow top, it's because I I use the Westland method and I solve with a I solve beige first. I don't solve I don't solve white. Um Yeah, no, this is literally the algorithm I just learned. Okay, sweet. So we got that one down. Kinda. Like, the way I learn algorithms is I, I learned this from an Anthony Brooks video and I feel like I kind of learn it in a derivative way to the way he learns it, which his method is good. Mine is probably very bad. But like, what he said was to memorize like the way an F2L pair moves. 
So like, let's say you're doing a J perm, you, you bring it out like that, and then you bring it there. And then you do sexy move, and then you bring it back, and then insert it. So like you memorize like a story with that pair. So whenever I'm, whenever I'm memorizing an alg, like when I'm first learning it, I don't care about my finger tricks. I use very bad finger tricks, but like I memorize like the way the F2L pair is moving first. And then the finger tricks kind of come naturally to me later, which isn't good. <laughs> like it's not good to, like you should practice finger tricks. It's just, I, I don't really do that. <laughs> um, okay. Wait, no, no, no. Okay. Okay, so that's the algorithm. Wait, no, 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 I did Okay. Okay, okay, okay. Also, another sort of, like, a flaw of my solving or my learning to solve is I memorize the case and I memorize the algorithm, <laughs> but I don't memorize the AUF. So um, let's say for like a ZBLL like that, I'm like, oh, I know how to do this. Um, what, what angle is it from? And then I do it like four times to figure out what angle I'm supposed to do it from. Uh, wait, I, I already forget which one I did. Okay, it was that one, okay. So, okay, so we have three algorithms technically under our belt. We have more than three. We have like five or more, I don't know. But, okay, and then this algorithm, uh, Ryan gives us three different algorithms that we could use. Or, yeah, yeah, three different algorithms that we could use. One of them is, lo looks like a mirror of the last one we did. But I think I'm honestly just gonna go with that because, uh, wait, no, that's not even the right algorithm. What? Wait, what is this? R2, D prime, R, U2. Oh, oh, that's, that's so weird. How they're like revert, okay. But yeah, anyway, I'm going with this one because I'm more familiar with it. And I could have done with that with the other one, but either way, this is that's that's the case that I'm looking at now. So we already have four out of twenty-two. This is easy, guys. <laughs> learning algorithms is easy, uh, or learning move sets. I don't like calling them algorithms for the sake of beginners. <laughs> um, okay, what is this? Oh, oh, they give us weird algorithms, or they give us weird things for this one. Okay, so F U2 prime, no, yeah, F U2 prime, R prime, D prime, R U2 prime, D, R, F prime. I don't like that one. Or maybe, maybe it's okay. Yeah, it's, it's easy to remember. Okay, so that's the one that looks like it should be the other three cycle, but the corners don't match up. Okay, easy. But I, I still don't really like that one very much. Okay, next case is a ca another case I already know. It's 
It's this one. Okay, so let's do that on the Mega. Okay, so it looks like this. Okay, easy. By the way, if you're wondering which Mega Minx I'm using, I'm using the, uh, the Diane Mega Minx, which is my favorite. I also really, another really popular one is the, uh, the YJ Yuhu, and I love the feel of that Mega Minx. It's just, it's too heavy, and I also don't like the ridges on it. Like, this one is very light and, like, easy for me to hold. The other one, while being a very nice puzzle, is, like, a bit too much for me, I guess. <laughs> I don't know why I'm I don't know why I'm reviewing that algorithm. I literally just learned it. Or I literally just I, I already know it is what I'm trying to say. Also, why am I solving on white? Yellow is my last layer. Um Okay, uh next algorithm. Okay. Uh R no R prime U prime R, F, R prime, U, R, U prime, F prime. Wait, no, uh. F. Okay, so. And then you, okay, so going back to the algorithm method learning thing I mentioned before, the way I sort of mentally reason this algorithm, like the way I visualize it is I take that pair out, do it F, put the pair back in, um, and then, and then put that pair back in and then do F prime. Okay, sweet. This one's fun. Wait, no, no, no. That's what I wanted to do. Okay, this. Okay, let's just real quick. That is. What is wrong with my fingers right now? Why can't I execute? I'm not good at D moves on a Mega Minx. Okay, so let's just review the last one I did because I feel like it's kind of blanking in my head. Like, not the one I was just doing, but the one two before that, I think. Wait, no, 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 it's... Wait, no, it's F, U2, or F, Oh, yeah, yeah, it's like that. Okay. Um, let me check chat. 
Okay. I'm back. Okay, welcome back. Sorry, I wasn't checking chat before. Um, is, hey, is that Mega ZB? Yes, it is. I think people. Oh no, I. I'm so sorry. I didn't see those. I, I was just so in the groove. Is so yes, it's Mega ZB. Except I'm not. It's not full ZBLL. It's only the cases where there's three corners that are missing. So like this entire block and these two corners are gonna be solved. Um, I'm, I'm only learning the ones that are three corners. Let me refresh the page. I, I... I feel so bad, I got, I got so in the groove, I didn't notice people came in. Oh no. Okay. Okay, so someone else is here now. Um, I will try not to ignore you. Oh, they left. Okay, never mind. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna try not to ignore everyone from here on out. I, uh... I... Yeah, I, I, I'm just... The reason why... Okay, I'm not paying much attention to chat right now because I'm drilling algorithms. Oh, it's Mega Last Three Corners. Yeah, yeah, exactly. Yeah, I'm drilling algorithms right now, so that's why I'm, like, not... <laughs> that's why I'm not paying attention to chat, so I apologize. Hey, Ryan! I, I'm glad that you could make it. I'm learning your algorithms right now, like, the ones that are, like, last three corners. Um, and... Uh, we got through about, I think, like, seven of them already? Like, they're really easy, and I, I think a lot of them I already know. Um, or like, like, cause like a lot of them transfer from 3x3, three three, like, you know, like the classic, that one. Uh, and then, something I discovered while I was doing this, which I mean is, I guess, basic Mega Minx knowledge, is that this translates to two different cases. Um, you could do that, or you could do YouTube Prime, and then get, like, this case instead. Except, except, also, also what I saw was you have a really interesting alg for, for that case. Like, the one that, how did it go? It went like, like that. Okay. Um, here, let me just, let me solve this real quick. Okay. Oh, that's interesting. That's interesting, okay. Let me just do two commutators and solve it. And then we have this case, which I know. Okay, anyway, uh, let's learn the next few algorithms. Well, first I'll check chat, and then... Yo, a heads up, I'm waiting for my boss to come to discuss, so I might have to abruptly leave. So, you're sort of out of frame while doing out- Wait, really? Wait, this whole time? Okay, only slightly. Like, that's sort of the theme of my streams. Like, I- Ryan comes in, tells me I'm out of frame, and then I'm like, really? <laughs> How do I fix it? Hang on. I could, like, bring the tripod up a bit. Like, I could... Uh... Hang on. Oh, oh, geez. Um, like, no, that was down. Technical difficulties. Uh, no, not, now it's completely out of frame. Okay, let's... What about if we bring it down, like, to here? No, but now it's gonna be... What if we zoom out a little? I don't know. I'll, we'll see if that works. Uh, okay, let me try lifting up my Mega Minx. Uh, okay, that's out of frame, so if I go down like this, then... Okay, so this is like a good spot to have to hold the Mega Minx in. 
Okay. Oh wait, I. Why did I move it? Okay. Anyway. Um. Okay, let's let's do some more algs. Um. So we have. Uh, okay, so we did um we did the first couple. Well, we did all of you, and then the first couple of T. I, I swear I'm gonna forget all of these algs once I start doing solves, but let's let's hope that's not the case. Um, okay. Okay, okay. Um, next is... So we just did this one. It was... It was, uh, the one where you where you do that, and you bring the pair back in, and then you do that. Like that one, okay. So next we need to, well first I need to solve it now that I messed it up. I don't know how to, I, I'm just, I'm just a humble ZZ solver. I don't know how to do this weird misoriented edge block building. <laughs> um, no, it's like, that, no, I, I fricked up the block. I'm okay. I, let me just do beginners. I'm doing weird, fancy things. Okay, that was embarrassing. Anyway, uh, and then we could solve it like that. No. Um, no. Wait, what, what was this? Okay, I, I said that these cases were very intuitive, but they're not coming to me right now. How would you like, okay. So this corner needs to go to here. So, okay. Okay, and then we, I'll, okay, I'm gonna learn these algos in a second. Um, okay. That RUD insert was correct. Yeah, I think I did the same insert twice, and then the third time I did the same insert, and then I'm like, yeah, that was the correct one. You should learn the easiest alg set for for each CO for now, so you do solves by two look, and that I, I think that could work. But also, I'm like kind of breezing through all these algs that you that you provided, so um, I think if I learn a few more, and then I figure that I, I can't remember what I just learned, I'm gonna start doing solves. But I think I could make it all the way through. Okay, so now we have... Uh, wait, what? What's the difference between... Oh, okay, I see, there's like a misplaced corner. I, I thought I saw another like like, the 2GLL type of case, and I was like, what's the difference between that one and this one? But no, it's, it's a very different case. Okay, so we just learned that one. Now we need to learn uh, this one, I believe. So, U R F prime, R prime, F, R, U, 2 prime, uh, this is weird. Yeah, I might, I might need to learn, I might need to stop learning algs and just get to solves now at this point. I, I'm, I'm now confused. Okay. Uh. Why did I do that? 
Okay, I guess we're we're doing regular we're doing regular Mega Minx right now. <laughs> okay, um, let me just review the ones I do know first before I get to solves. And then we could what we could do is we could take a break to, to do solves and then get back to learning more algorithms, or we could just continue doing solves for the rest of the day. Who knows? Um, but okay, so the ones I learned were uh, that one. No. Wait, no, 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 no. Like that? Wait, no, no, no. Like... Okay, so that one I already knew to begin with. And then we learned... Uh, No, 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 no. Okay, I, uh, well, I, I hesitated there because I realized I was doing the wrong, that wasn't what we learned next is what I was trying to say. What did we learn after that? It was, um, it's like I remember, but I don't, like I remember what the case looked like, but I don't remember what the algorithm was. F prime. R U two R prime U two R prime F R U. Oh yeah, it was this one. I think I I think I did it wrong the first time. Wait no. Wait no 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 it's U two prime both times. Okay, so we learned that, and then we learned the other U2 case, and then it was commutator, and then it was um, this, I believe? Uh, I think it was that one. Is like the last one in U. Oh no, it's not. No, it was uh, this one. Wait, no. That one. Okay, sweet. Okay, let's get to solves, and then later on we could get back to um, later on we could get back to learning more algorithms. Um, I also need to update that alg sheet because I found some cool hand wait algs by hand just by playing around with the cube. Nice. <laughs> Yeah, it's nice 2GL, some 2GLs directly transfer. I'm really annoyed that Pure Soon doesn't directly transfer. Um, okay, let's okay, let's solve this and then we'll scramble up the the mega. Wait, no, like that. And then next we need to do this. I'm still getting used to like this weird block building thing. The... <sighs> Petrus users are cringing at me right now. Um, I, th I think it's, okay, this one I actually don't think I know. I hope you're ready for BR and BL moves, LMAO. Oh, oh no, you're gonna update the L sheet to have B, oh dear. Uh, I'm just gonna suggest don't do that, but it's your call, it's your L sheet, man. So, if, wait, what if we do this? Okay, yeah, yeah, that works, a simple commutator. I am so glad, okay, even though I never ended up using even though I never ended up using, uh, like, Orozco and, three bl and, like, doing three blind, I'm so glad that I at least, like, I'm so glad that I at least practiced Orozco when I was starting out, because that gave me, like, all of my commutator knowledge. And, um, now I could actually do commutators because of that method. 
Um, Mega. Okay, apparently I haven't done any Mega solves or like any time solves in probably over a year. And it says that I average two minutes and 40 seconds about. My, my alt, wait, hang on. In my alg sheet for other people to use, I have like, I like to have simpler, easier, more consistent options as well as harder algs that should be a little better. That makes sense. Okay, anyway, I'm gonna hide chat. Or no, no, I don't have to hide chat. I could just have it like right on the side right there. And let's start scrambling up the mega. We have green in front, white top, and then plus, minus, minus, plus, 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 minus, 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 U prime, plus, minus, Wait, no, 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 plus, 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 minus, plus, minus, plus, minus, U prime. Plus, 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 minus, 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 plus, U prime. I'm gonna, okay, look, actually let me go a little bit slower so I don't, I don't hurt myself. <laughs> minus, plus, minus, plus. I didn't realize how aesthetic carrot notation was until now. Okay, so as I mentioned before, I solve predominantly on, or I, no, completely, I only solve on beige. And I see like a little one by two by two I can create here, and I see these two. So I don't know, like, I'm not very good with efficiency yet. It's something I need to improve upon, but like I see that I can solve stuff like this. And then I could also solve like a block here. And then, oh, I have an edge right there, okay. And then, uh, what do we got, what do we got? I, I lost track of that edge. It's like cardinal sin of Mega Minx, don't, it's like you need to look ahead. Do not stop looking ahead. I stopped looking ahead <laughs> after I said that. Okay, and I, okay, I'm just gonna, I have to stop talking. Like, I'm just not looking ahead at all. And then that's uh, that edge. We need this to uh, go in here. And then we could pair up these. Rotate, do that. Okay, now we're up to this. I normally solve, okay, so my set color scheme in the past was to solve, um, was to solve blue first, like the blue cross or blue star after you solve S2L. But now I'm gonna start solving on white first because I feel like it's a little bit easier to see when I'm doing uh, Omega. Where's, okay, where's the, that's not what I was looking for. This is what I was looking for. Okay, now. Um, blue, green. And then we have orange, green next. I'm, I'm not looking ahead very well. Wait, what? What the heck? No, 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 that doesn't come next. This comes next. Now comes the... 
Uh, well, actually, wait, no. Let's solve. Let's solve green or white, purple, green first because we don't want to end up with white for the last part. And then let's solve this. And then now we can work on our block. Like that, and then we separate purple. Oh dear. Oh wait, I accidentally solved a block while I was trying to solve that block. And we have edges just skipped. And we have one I know. That was a lucky first solve. 25909. Okay, so that's a bit slower than I was expecting. I expected to improve in the past year, but apparently not by, not by much. Also, I don't know. I, I feel like my block building left something to be desired there. Wow, that was super nice luck. Yeah, I know. <laughs> like, okay, I'm gonna be honest. When I first learned the Mehta method, like probably a few days before I decided to learn ZZ, the very first solve I did, I got like three different skips. And I thought that that was what the method was like. I thought like, wow, like that, that was like a fast way of solving it. I, I see why it's a good method, but in actuality, I skipped like three steps by accident. <laughs> so yeah, anyway. Let's, uh, okay, let's scramble it up again. Plus, minus, plus, minus, minus, plus. I feel like scrambling up a Mega Minx, for me personally, is like the easiest to read. Like everyone complains, or no wait, no, that was the wrong scramble. Okay, so I think now we're back on track. Um, it's the easiest to read. Everyone complains that scrambling Mega is hard, but I feel like it's, it's like, it's this nice to look at. Like there's only like two possible moves that you can do when scrambling up, when scrambling it up, so, wait, no. Okay. Wait, no, no, I keep doing, I keep doing, um, what's it called? Minus, Plus when I mean to do minus minus. That's minus minus, okay. Okay, now now what? Now what? Now we got okay, we I see a pair right here and I see the edge. So I could start by making I could start by making that block. Okay, okay. Uh, could I find the other edge? Oh, there it is. Curse of the Mega Minx. You look all around the puzzle for the edge when it's right next to the piece that you were originally looking at. Um, <clears throat> okay. Okay, so we have that edge solved. I don't want to bring that one down yet. I want to be able to block build. I don't want to make like a cross. Okay, next. I lost track of this. Okay. Where is the, there it is. Honestly, like I have not enjoyed Mega Minx this much in a long time. I'm having fun. Okay. 
Uh, first layer done, now we move to white. Uh, and then, white, blue, and then we need blue, red, like that. And then we'll do that move to get this in here. I, when I first began Mega Minx, my method that I used, which I thought was efficient because it is like the objectively optimal way of solving a three by three, but apparently it's not that good on Mega Minx, is I used to solve fully color neutral. Like I solved F2L color neutral and I did not have an order for solving S2L. And it was clear that it was a bad method to me, like, like for me personally, because I spent like way too long looking for each piece and I forgot what I was, I forgot what I needed to solve next every time. Uh, okay. And now block. Um, okay, purple. And then like that. And then sledgehammer to solve that, and then we need uh, this case. Which I feel like is much easier to execute on a 3x3. Three three. I didn't mean to do that, but it worked out, okay. 229.59. Okay. I'll be on, oh wow, it's been almost an hour already. I guess time flies when you're having fun. I, I'll be honest, the reason why I began streaming so late today is cause in the morning I went out for breakfast. Wait. By the way, you're missing out on a way to improve your S2L by auto ro by auto Y rotating? Wait, what do you mean by that? How do you auto Y rotate? Do you get, do you get like a robot to rotate for you? I don't, I don't understand what that means. Um, okay, so I, I went out for breakfast this morning and when I came back, my mom was on her laptop, like, sitting in my spot to stream. And it's not like, okay, again, I stream in my kitchen <laughs> because that's the only place I have to stream. Like, there's no desk in my room and the living room doesn't have any good place either. So, um, I'm in my kitchen right now, <laughs> basically. Um, and so yeah, she was just sitting there and I... I didn't want to like kick her out and I, so I just kind of went to my room and went on my computer until she left and she happened to leave at like 2.30. Okay, after you complete a block, oh, wait, after you complete A the block on the F face, you immediately, you're immediately doing a Y rotation to the next face on the right. I mean, yeah, but isn't that, I don't, I don't get what I'm supposed to do then. <laughs> Cause like, okay, um, oh wait, oh wait, you, you continued, I apologize. But what you can do is see if an easy, wait, see if it's easy to place the next bottom edge and solve the pair between the edge and the, and the current front block. Okay, I see. Like, my issue, I guess, with, like, not rotating is the fact that, like, if, if you have, like, misoriented edges, it's better to, uh, I, I feel like it's, it, it might be better to do, like, to rotate and do that instead. But I'll try to do that next solve. Okay, um, by the way, um, I won't, something I should mention is I won't be able to stream tomorrow because um, I'm gonna be, I'm, I'm technically gonna be moving. Um, I, I'd rather not get into it, it's, it's, it's weird. 
But uh, literally nothing's going to change for you. It's going to look like I'm in the same place. And I, I will not elaborate as to why. <laughs> but um, anyway, uh, I noticed that you're doing F, R, U, F prime to solve FL pair, which is, which is good. But this can be, this can also add, wait, this can also add more lefty turning, which could be good and bad. Okay. Yeah, I'm gonna try to not, I'm gonna try to rotate less um, next solve. But anyway, my point is I'm gonna be busy all day tomorrow moving. Um, and then uh, the reason why I brought that up now is because I was about to say, wait, not the FRU, okay. I was about to say that I'm, uh, it's a good thing I don't have to stream tomorrow because I don't want to, like, push myself to my limit with my wrist. And because, like, right now I feel like Megaminx... It, Megaminx is, like, something that's sort of, like, can sometimes be hard on my wrist, but not always. Um, and right now it kind of is. Oh, hell yeah, Race Against the Sunset. It's my favorite song on this uh, royalty-free playlist. No. Minus, plus, minus, minus. Okay. So yeah, like, what I was saying before is I'm gonna, like, I'm gonna be busy tomorrow, which is gonna be a good break for my wrist. Like a good rest for my wrist. I'm not gonna break my wrist tomorrow. <laughs> At least I hope not. Um, I, okay. Let's just get started with the solve. Oh, that, that would have been a DNF, but luckily we are not in um, a competition. Um, I have a bad habit of doing that. Like just kind of like turning to see like what I would do and then putting it down and starting the timer. I have to, I have to stop myself from doing that. Um, so that way I don't do that during the competition. <laughs> uh, <laughs> okay. Uh, okay. So we can solve this block is all I wanted to say. And then that, okay. Uh, Did you get registered? Not yet. The WCA website was down yesterday and I was busy this morning. I'm gonna, I'm gonna do, I'll do it. I'll tell you what, I'll do it right after the stream. Um, okay. Where is, I forgot to look ahead. Wait, what? Oh. Okay, uh... Okay, S2L. Uh, time to not rotate. Um, okay, so do not rotate here. I guess. Uh... <laughs> B, <laughs> we're doing B moves now. Um, okay. Oh yeah, yeah, see that was nicer without rotating. Um, okay, let's uh, keep this in the front, I guess. And then... Uh, 
Okay, so this fits. Up. Okay. Wait, no. Okay, so let's uh, do that. <laughs> that was like the most intuitive thing for me at the moment, but then it quickly turned into being disgusting. <laughs> Oh dear, oh no. Okay. Um, I don't know how to... This is so confusing to me. Okay, there we go. Uh, no, wrong way. Uh, that's what I wanted to do. Okay, and now we have... Uh, this. I'll, I'll just do two commutators, or I'll do a commutator and this. And now we have a case I don't know yet. Okay. Uh, oh dear. Okay, I don't know. I don't know how to do the OLL for that case. <laughs> so, or like, I don't know how to do an OLL that doesn't break up the block. Three eighteen fifty one. That was not very good. I mean, it was a DNF anyway. I, I turned the cube before starting. It was a DNF, no. I, I'm not, I'm sort of being more lenient with my, um, the, I'm being more lenient with the way I'm doing uh, like my inspection and stuff like that. I'm trying not to rush inspection so that way I could like, yeah. I, I don't know what I'm saying. Okay, real quick, I'm just gonna... No, I don't want to do the... Okay, I should have brought out a second Mega Minx, you know? But, like, I should have I should have had two with me, so that way I could drill Alex on one and then solve with the other. And I, I don't want to get one right now, because... Yeah. Anyway. Okay. I'm having a lot of fun this stream. Like I I Mega Minx isn't one of my favorite puzzles. I feel like like I'm too um what's the word? I'm too scatterbrained to do Mega Minx because I I feel like it cuz like I went through a period where I just felt like a lot of puzzles took too long, so like I preferred like 2x2 two two and Pyraminx. Um, now I'm kind of past that because like I, you know, I solved the 11x11 11 11, like every week. So I kind of have to be past that. But um, Mega Minx used to be too much for me. What the hell? <laughs> there were nine plus pluses in a row in this scramble. It's kind of like that thing where, um, what's it called? Where like when you flip a coin, it's gonna flip the same one eight times in a row and people don't, people don't realize that. Um, Wait, no, no, it's plus, minus, 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 plus, 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 minus, minus, plus, U prime. And then plus, minus, minus, plus, minus, minus, plus, minus, minus, minus. Uh, minus, plus, minus, minus, plus, minus. Minus, plus, 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 minus, plus, uh, 
plus, minus, 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 plus, minus, minus, minus u. Okay. Okay. Uh, I see, once again, I see pieces to build the red, green, um, uh, the red, green, beige. So let's, let's do that and let's look ahead to, I guess, uh, red, pink, beige. Uh, like that. And then I see red, pink. I do not see uh, pink, beige anywhere. There it is. Um, okay, we need gray. Um, where? Ah, there it is. And then... Frick! Okay, awesome. Wait, no, 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 no. Okay, here we go. And then... Uh, do not rotate? Wait, what? Wait, huh? Wait, what am I doing? What, what, why does this look so weird to me? I, I forgot the blue, that's why. Okay. Wait, no, no, don't rotate yet. <laughs> uh... I forget whose average it was, but I remember seeing, like, one of the, I believe, Mega Minx, like, world record averages, and being like, how do you turn that fast? Because, like, back then, back then I was like, I can barely turn, like, I didn't know how to do Mega Minx finger tricks, I didn't know that you had to do, like, U2 like that. Um... So I was very confused at how anyone could turn a Mega Minx like well, much less fast. Oh jeez, okay. Wait, no, 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 no. Let's, let's not solve that edge because I want to keep that open. Uh, okay, and then. Okay, uh... Okay, this block is much easier than the other one. I think part of the reason why I'm slow also could be because I'm, you know, I'm using a different method than I'm used to. Uh, okay. And then, like that. And then, uh... Wait, no. Okay. Got it? Um... Okay, I believe this is uh, Niklas. Or no, it's not. Wait, is it? No, it's not. Okay. Uh, okay, so this is... I can only do... Well, actually, wait, no, no. I, could, I should do Niklas to... Uh, to solve OLL. And then do that. 322.58. I'm surprised that that one is so slow. Because it felt like I was going pretty fast there. I'm like slowing down, like what's the deal? That's so weird. Okay, am I out of frame at all? Cause I, I'm now paranoid about that. Okay, no, it looks like everything's good. Um, okay, I'm just gonna take like a, like maybe 60 second, two minute break to like make sure my wrist is okay. <laughs> Cause like, I, I really, I, okay. I, like, I don't want to push myself to my limits. Like I went through, I had to like wear a wrist brace for a month because I pushed myself to my limits with cubing. So I'm just going to like sit here for like a few minutes to like give myself a rest. Um, let me drink some water.
Okay, so um, I don't know. I'm just I'm just gonna talk about something else that comes to mind, which is D and D, as always, because I'm a nerd. Um, I mentioned last time the uh, Icewind Dale campaign I was in, and the uh, I sort of narrated, uh, uh, broke down all the characters that I was um, that I was in a party with. There was my character who was the Durgar Bard. Um, there was my friend Daniel's character, Ace Diamond, who was... I didn't mention, he was a tiefling, uh, sorcerer, I believe. I don't think I mentioned that last time. And then there was, uh, Bonker, the warlock, the Kenku warlock. And then, um, I don't remember. But anyway, the important part, the thing I'm gonna say is, um, my character was very um like fatherly i made him tell like dad jokes and like sort of like look after the party and i just kind of really leaned into like stereotypical dad personality for this character because i thought it was fun to play and uh okay i guess i, I guess i'm ready to continue but okay my point is um my character uh, I mentioned is a Durgar and or was a Durgar because I don't play that character anymore. But um, and he uh, and in Icewind Dale, there's a lot of uh, there's a lot of Durgar. And um, like if you don't know what a Durgar is, it's like an evil dwarf type of thing. It, like they're purple. It's weird, but I think they're cool. Um, I feel like I did the scramble wrong. Let's just keep going. <laughs> uh, okay. So, one of the enemies we had to fight was another... Was, like, another Durgar who was, like, trying to build this, like, giant crystal dragon thing. Um, and, like, his dad was, like, kind of... Like, not the main villain, but, a, like, a pretty big villain for part of the story. All right, now. I'm messing up the scramble now that I'm talking, but I want to make it interesting. I, I don't remember the character's name, but I feel like if you're familiar with D&D &D and you played that campaign in particular, you probably know who I'm talking about. But, um... What we did was, um... Hang on. Uh, minus, minus, plus, minus, U, plus, 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 minus, plus, 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 minus, U prime. Okay. So, uh, okay, before I get into the, uh, solve, I want to finish what I was saying. So, like, what we did in that, uh, like, D&D &D campaign, or, like, what our characters did, is once we got, we got through that dungeon... And then, um, like, hang on, <laughs> Sorry. uh, we got through that, we got through that dungeon and then we were, uh, I, I messed up the scramble, but we, we, uh, we've got through that dungeon. We, um, uh, in the game, like we kidnapped that character to get like information out of him and fi to figure out like what the bad guys were doing, you know? And then, um, <clears throat> The character was like, um, what's it called? Like he said, he said like, oh, you'll pay for this. My dad is going to get you in trouble. Like, 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 like the, the nerd he is, I guess. And then to which I replied as my character to him in Undercommon. I said, welcome to the family. I am your dad now. And then everyone at the table was like, that is the scariest line I have ever heard. What the hell? <laughs> so yeah, I basically threatened a, uh, an adolescent villain character in the game and told him that I was his father, even though I wasn't. <laughs> anyway, um, 
uh, we can make a block like that, and then we can make this, and then we could uh, move on to blue. Okay. Okay. Um, Why was that F2L so smooth? I mean, I'm not done with it yet, but that was... That felt so good, what the heck? I don't know what I did differently there, but that felt way better than like, than normal. And then we fumble S2L, like always. <laughs> um, okay, let's get that blue edge to the bottom, so that way we could fill in that block, and then... Uh, get this edge there and then fill in that pair and then we could do this no not that this okay um, and then we hold it like this um, solve into the back without rotating like uh, Ryan suggested um, <laughs> I'm like afraid to rotate now because I want I want to like try to get better, but I'm not sure when to rotate and when not to. Okay, um, next, ah, crap. And then we have this. And then, uh, uh, hang on, I, I see that you sent a, re uh, a message, Ryan, but I don't have chat like fully open, so I can't read it yet. Hang on. Um, okay. Now we have purple, white? I believe we need to solve, yeah, purple, white, um, like that. And then, now what? Okay, now, I, I, I knew there was a better way of solving that, but I missed out on whatever it was. Okay, and then, 23854. So pretty good because like I, I think all that time save came from F2L because that was like that was like a good F2L. That was like a 20 or 30 second F2L, I think. Um Yeah, you're good on the rotation thing. You'll get a feel for it when when it's good and not good. Usually the biggest thing to note is the EO of the bottom edge and the slot edge. Okay. Okay, so I See, I'm, I'm not used to paying attention to EO because like I'm used to solving EO and then not worrying about it for the rest of the solve. <laughs> but, um, but yeah. Yeah, there, okay. In that last solve, I did um, the edges inefficiently because I saw that we had a case, like we, we had um, like, we had like this, or not that, but uh, like that, but we had it with these two edges instead of these two. So like my instinct was to rotate and then do that algorithm, which would have, which would have worked. But then I was like, I don't want to rotate. Rotating is slow. And then I did a longer, less efficient algorithm. So um, yeah, I should have rotated there. <laughs> Or I should have at least like visualized like what to do instead of what I did. <clears throat> okay, let's clear the timer. Um, we yeah we recorded it. It doesn't matter. Um, okay, minus 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 plus minus plus minus minus plus. Wait. Okay, uh, plus U prime minus 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 plus plus 
plus minus plus minus plus u The thing is, okay, we haven't been getting any of the algorithms that I learned that I needed to drill, which is unfortunate. I think next stream, I'm gonna need to do more drilling of algs because I think we're doing pretty good. Like, like, we're okay, we're at least doing okay with the Mega Minx and I don't wanna like lose that. And I also want to like, I wanna have the Omega method under my belt. And I possibly want to learn like a few alg algorithms to help me one look the last slot but I don't know if that's gonna happen yet. Okay, um, what do we got? Okay, we, once again, um, we have these three pieces, but it doesn't look like a very good solution, so I might not do it this time. Or maybe I can. Yeah, if I if I do U two or sorry, yeah, U prime and then this one like U two R two whatever you call it, then I could separate them and then pair up that. Okay. Uh. Okay, that was less efficient, like what I did at the end there, but we it's it's okay. It's solved now. Um. I lost track of what I was doing. Okay, that's solved incorrectly. We'll fix it in a second. I just want to get the actual piece over to where it needs to be. That's not the piece I was looking for. I am, I am freaking up right now. Okay, um... Okay, there we go, there we go. Oh, crap. Wait, no, 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 why am I solving that? I'm, I need to solve white. That's, that's my set, like, color scheme. And then we need to solve uh, this next. Oh wait, I I rotated when I shouldn't have. Okay. Ah, um. oh, frick. I'm I'm feeling I'm feeling less good about this one, guys. This one feels very strange. Okay. Um. And then insert that, and then we do white. Where the hell? Oh. Okay, now. Okay, okay. Hmm, what do I need? Uh, I. I I always struggle with this block step because it's like a different type. I thought like, oh, I'm good at block building. I could do this, but it's like a different type of block building is the problem. Uh, 
<laughs> okay, what if I don't do that? <laughs> or that? Okay. Well, that sucked. Oh, last layer skip. Cool. Uh, 305.72. I, I honestly, okay, a last layer skip was very much needed for this solve, but I d I'm, I'm in the process of learning a new method. I don't think I want a last layer skip. I want a case that I, I should, you know, I want a case to drill. I want to be able to, uh, yeah. Okay, um, honestly, I um, am gonna, I'm gonna take it easy. I'm gonna end the stream by drilling more algs. I don't think I wanna do any more solves because I, I feel like scrambling up this thing could potentially like hurt my wrist. So. So um, let's open up the alg sheet again and then Oh God, okay. I, I might need another break. The thing is, I've kind of decided that I I do want to still continue with Skew, Mega Minx, and Square One, even though, even though it could potentially like be bad for me. But at the same time, like I like the way I'm gonna do it is I'm gonna be a lot more careful. But I, it's it's hard to get better if you're just careful though is the problem. But like I, I feel like it's sort of a decision of do I want to be better or do I want to potentially risk not being able to cube at all. So I am gonna choose. Y you know. So I'm gonna... So like, I want to... Like, I want to be able to, um... Uh, what's the word? So I'm gonna, like... The reason why I'm stopping solves for right now is because like I, I, I know myself and I know that if I keep going then it's gonna get a lot worse. So I'm gonna just do some algs. Um, for Skub, learning NS will help you... Well, the problem is I know NS. I mean, I don't know full NS, but I know like a lot of NS. And I, I use it, <clears throat> I mean, okay, not a lot. I know, I don't know why I said a lot. I, I'm saying a lot of the algorithms I use are NS algs. So, um, so I'm not sure which alg is the problem for me because I, I agree with you that's probably part of the problem is that like I'm doing something weird but the one of the algs is like the one that's kind of like actually detrimental and I don't know which one what do you average on mega um right now I average also good to have you on the stream Mike um right now I average around three minutes um, it, this is the first day in a very long time I did timed solves. I think this is also the first time in like a while that I picked up a Mega Minx. Because Mega Minx isn't like a very common puzzle for me. Um, and for Mega, do, uh, you could alleviate some strain from scrambling with better, with a better scramble technique. Yeah, yeah. I don't know, I, I, I don't, I don't know like what the better scramble technique would be though. But anyway, let's get let's get to the algs again. Um, okay. Um, here I'm gonna let me I'm gonna open up chat in a new window and like kind of shrink it down. 
so that way I could read chat while I'm doing elves. Um, okay. So we're going to do more of this. And now we have... Um, okay, so I'm going to review the ones I did so far, which... No, 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 I opened my, I opened my stream in a new tab, that was an accident, um, okay, um, okay, so I have, uh, okay, so I have this. First album we learned was, uh, this one, which, again, I already know. And then, like that. And then second alg I learned was uh, that. Third was uh, this one. And I'm not gonna do that one over and over again because I know that it'll, okay. And let me try to reverse it to learn this case. So it looks like, it looks the same as the one on 3x3. Three three. Um, I already forget how to reverse it. <laughs> okay, um, okay, let's just solve that like that for now, and then, okay. So yeah, that was the third alg I learned. The fourth one was uh, this, which I already knew again. Fifth is um, this, I think. Wait, no, 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 it was F is to start. And then you do that. F prime, that wasn't very good execution. Why am I using my thumb? I have the same problem with FTO, like I do U moves with my thumb. Like, that wasn't a good example. Like, I don't know, when I have it like this, and then I do like that sometimes, or like that I think I do, I don't, I don't know what I do, but I, I have the same problem. I do U moves with my thumb for some reason, which isn't good. Wait. Um, wait, is it you? Wait, is this one U two prime or U two? Oh wait, no, I did it the wrong direction. That's why. That's why. I I'm sorry. Okay, let's, uh, let's fix what I messed up just now. Okay, um, okay, so it's this case. And then we have uh, this. No, that was the wrong algorithm, never mind. <laughs> okay. Do you know for look last layer or anything else? Um, I do know for look last layer. Um, right now, right now we're actually learning the Omega method though. I'm learning, um, I'm learning uh, last three corner algorithms. Like, Omega is kind of like tripod on 3x3. Three three. And the reason why I'm... I, I don't think Omega is, like, the fastest way. I think to look, like, last layer is the fastest method so far. But I, I think it'll honestly be more fun for me. I, I, like, I like methods that are more fun. Okay. Uh, so, for, so we're up to, so we, I mentioned I learned this algorithm. 
Uh, let's let's try to get good execution on it. How do you how do you do the D move there? F, okay, two, and then you do that, and then you do that, and then you do that. But like the D move just feels so wrong. If I hold it like this, maybe. Would no 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 no. I want to do that and then that and then that. So the algorithms I'm drilling right now, Mike, are um, last. Oh, left thumb. Thank you. Uh, so the algorithms I'm drilling right now are last three corners. Uh, okay. So. Oh, the, oh God. Okay, thank you guys. That feels so good. That feels so good. Okay. Hey. Hello. I'm, I'm currently busy. Like, please, like. I can't answer again. No. Are you recording something? Yes. Okay. See you later. Uh, that was my mom. Okay. So, anyway. Nice to see you guys talking in the chat. <laughs> okay. I, um... Okay, so yeah. The... D-move feel... D-move with thumb feels very good. No other way. <laughs> okay, so... Like that. Okay, okay, cool. Cool, cool. Um, next one is um, uh, the 2GLL, which again, I already know. And then it was uh, this one. Uh, okay. I need to like, okay, this one is a bit, is a bit tougher, I'd say. Um, or like, it's a bit tougher to, like, I, no, no, it's, it's, it's not tough at all. I don't know what I'm saying. I guess I'm just kind of struggling with it. <clears throat> but let me just, let me just fix, uh, what I'm doing right now is I'm just fixing the last layer again. I suck at this block. That's something I'll get better with over time, I think. Okay, and then that, and then uh, this. No, not, that wasn't right. This is right. That wasn't right either. <laughs> this is right. <laughs> okay, that, that was embarrassing. And then it's this algorithm that I tried to do earlier, but I failed. Okay, um. Okay, anyway. Um. It was, okay, so it was uh, this algorithm that I was practicing before. How, what did I do? Okay, I tried to, I tried to reverse the algorithm so that way I could just go straight back to, um, you know. Um, I tried to reverse it so I could just go straight back to last layer, but I failed. Okay. Um, and then, uh, is this Niklas, I think? Hey, Niklas, okay, yeah, yeah, I did it right. Um, anyway, uh... Next is, okay, so I, I know that algorithm now. Wait, what does the, and the case looks like, kind of like uh, this one, but like with the corner like reversed, I guess. And then the next one is, the next one looks like this one, I believe, like a little bit. Um, yeah, yeah, it looks like, 
Or no, 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 it looks like the opposite one, like with the cor when the corner is up here. But yeah. <clears throat> okay, so how do you, what does that one look like as I'm doing it? You, okay, you two. Okay, I haven't drilled this one at all yet. We're in new territory. Okay, R, U, R prime, F prime, R. Oh wait, no, no, I did this one earlier and I failed. <laughs> Okay, R U R prime F prime R prime F R U two prime R prime F prime R F R U R prime I believe. Okay, that that one's interesting. Okay, I don't know, I don't know the good finger tricks for that one. Okay, that seems good. That one could, that one potentially is very fast. Okay. Um, cool. I think, okay, one good way, and as in good way, I mean very bad way, but I might do it anyway, um, is once I get to last two faces, I might do like partial EO or like think about EO. So that way I don't have like bad block building. <laughs> but anyway, uh, or, I, or I could just improve on block building. That's probably the second option. Um, okay, next algorithm is, uh, yeah, you can do that. Okay, okay, I got the Ryan seal of approval. Nice. Um, it will just restrict how you could build the 223. Yeah, but also, I, I don't know, I, I'm stupid and I can't, like, build the 223 very well anyway. But we'll, we'll see. I'll, I'll, I'll think of something. I'll, I'll figure out. Like block the two two, the two two three will become more natural to me. I'm sure. Or I know it's a one by two by three. Either way, it'll become more natural to me. Um, okay. So next algorithm. R prime u two, r prime f, r u two, r u two, r prime f. That I don't think I did that right. Okay, I, I screwed something up, but I can't tell what. Okay. White, green. White, green. I mean, it's day one. Don't doubt yourself. Thank you. Honestly, I, I, like, I feel like that's something that I should know by now. Like, oh yeah, I'm just learning. I, I'm, yeah. But I'm super, um, I guess, I, I, I don't know, I, I didn't think about that. I, I just thought like, oh, I'm, I'm not doing so well, even though I should have realized that I'm just starting out. Okay, so we, uh, commutator. Okay, and then the algorithm I literally just learned, I think. Oh no, wait, this is a different, wait, what? Wait, which one is this? Did I learn it yet? Oh, it's that one. Okay. Wait, no. Wait, no, I did that from the wrong angle. I did that from the wrong angle, gosh dang it. You could do X, R, U, D, L, like from three by three, from E perm. How did I not see that? Wait, that, that's literally right below, that's literally right below the one I was doing. Okay, I'll do that next time. Hang on, so. Okay, so.
Okay, so that's an actual EPIRM, what I just did by accident, but, um, okay, ah, oh, nice, I average like sub one when warmed up, no for loop last layer in learning ZU and Q sets. That's really cool. Um, Mega Mink's last layer, or like PLL, is pretty intimidating for, to me for some reason. Like, I know a lot of ZBLL on 3x3, and like, that's the outset everyone's scared of, but for some reason, Mega Mink's last layer, I'm like, no, I don't want to touch that. So, I'm hoping once I get uh, all the PLLs down, so, what, so I bet, wait. I'm hoping once I get all the PLLs down, so I bad case, oh, it doesn't kill me, it doesn't kill my times will let me, ch I'm having, I am so sorry, Ryan, I'm having so much trouble reading that sentence, I do not understand what you're saying, <laughs> dude, mega PLLs feel both easy, uh, dude, mega feel both easier and harder to learn. I heard X cases are harder to recognize. Yeah, yeah, see. I, ZBLL so far has been much easier than I thought. Like I chipped into 2GLL and I was like, okay, I don't wanna learn any more ZBLL. But then once I started learning T, I'm like, this is, this is nice. This is a nice alg set. Um, I think the stream has been two hours, but I want to keep going. Um, okay. Uh, what do we got? Oh yeah, it's this case again. So U2 and then, okay. R, U, D, R, U, R prime, D? No, 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 no. Um, but they aren't too hard to recognize, but it takes a lot of work to get fast at recognizing them. Um, okay. Wait, what is this? Why can't I... U2 prime, and then R U R prime D, R U prime R prime D prime. That, no, that's wrong. Wait, what? I can't tell if you wrote that wrong or if I'm reading it wrong. I don't, I, I feel like, I don't know. Maybe it's, you did the alg but at the wrong angle. Wait, oh, I did X pro, okay. Wait, no, what? Wait, put the T on the front, wait, what? I don't understand. <laughs> okay, um, I'm just gonna go back to the other one. Wait, what? Okay, I said I would go back to the other one, but this one's also really weird. Okay. Oh, wait. And then, oh, that's what you meant by put the T in the front. I'm so sorry. Okay, the twisted, okay, so like here. Like that? Okay, that was correct, but I did an E perm instead, or I set up to an E perm. Okay, okay, that's easy. That's easy, I get it now. Uh, and that's how you do an E perm on Mega Minx. I feel like if I knew an E perm on this puzzle a while ago, that I, I would have gotten a lot faster. Um, okay, so that algorithm took me way longer than necessary. Wait, hang on. It was. Are you? Do you? Okay. Wait, no, 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 no. Okay.
Okay, got it. Um, okay, so that's easy now. And then, it, then there's this one. Okay, I have to get used to that. Okay, so you hold it on the right. You hold the T on the right for this case. Okay, easy. Um, how many more do we have? We have like 10 more. Do I want to do 10 more? How much time do I, like, or, I mean, I have plenty of time. I could go like for hours if I wanted to, but how long of, Okay, we haven't been streaming for two hours yet. So I feel like I feel like I could still keep going. Like I thought we were I thought we were over two hours and I was like, oh I should stop soon, but no, we got plenty of time. Okay, uh okay, um so next case. Okay, oh nice, it's another two gen case. Um so that's the other T case that's like weird. Like it's, it's this, but from the other angle. Or no, no, it is this. It's literally this case, okay. Um, let's try it. R, U2, R prime, U2. Oh wait, no, this isn't two gen. This isn't two gen at all. Um, okay, uh, R, U2, R prime, U2, R prime, F. R U2 prime? Oh, wait, no, no, I did this last time and I failed. I, something tells me I'm not gonna like this one. F R, oh, let's try the other alg. F R U R2 prime, U prime, R prime, F prime. R U R2, U prime, R prime. That one's hard to memorize. Okay, this is a case I should already know. I think it's this one. Yeah, okay. Um, anyway, I, I, okay, I think those two algs might be the same, but revert, no, they're not. They are not at all. I just, that was just a blind guess and it, it was not correct. Um, Okay, uh, this one is hard. Okay, let's try again. U2 prime, U2, sl oh wait, no, no, it's, it's F prime, that's what I did wrong. U2 prime, R, U2, R, okay. Okay, okay, so it is similar to the other one, actually. Which I didn't expect. Okay, so when you have this case, then you hold the T in the front, like Ryan said earlier, and then you do no, you don't do that. Uh, like that, okay. Okay, sweet, sweet. Um, next case. And we're almost, we're almost done with T. I don't think we're gonna learn all these algs on stream. I feel like there's gonna be a few missing, but let's just let's just do a few more before we end. Um, okay, next case is there's one more T case. Um, okay, I'm gonna do the shorter looking one. So F U prime R prime U prime R U F prime. I think that's a Z B L L. That felt very familiar. Why does that, that feel 
feels so familiar. Is that like, is, I'm pretty sure that might be a ZBLL. Either that or I'm just, I don't know, smarter than I thought I was. <laughs> Okay, so when you have that corner in the back, then you hold that in the front and then it's this. Okay, easy. Um, it's similar to one of the Soon 2 GLLs. Really? That's weird because it's not 2 Gen. <laughs> weird, okay. Um... Okay. Okay, next case is... Why did I go down there? Okay. Okay, so we're on to L. Well, okay, just, just as an experiment, I want to see. Is this case a three-corner case? It is not a three-corner case. Okay. Wait, hold up. Okay. Okay, I'm just gonna keep doing this until it goes back to solve, a solved state. Okay, sweet. Um, yeah, but it's it's just do F move, take out the pair, undo F move, put pair back in kind of vibe. Yeah, yeah, makes sense. Okay. Um, are you two? Okay, so this is like the this is like the two GLL but in reverse, I believe. Oh wait, no, except I did it wrong. Okay, I screwed it up. Here, let me do that and then Okay. Um, no. Okay. And this is another case I should know, but I, oh wait, yes, I do know it. Okay, easy. Um, okay, so this looks like a 2GLL I know, but just with different U2 moves. R, U2, R prime, U2, R prime, U prime, R, U prime. Okay, so I guess it does change. What? R, U2, R2, U, no, that's not, wait, no, I didn't do it right. What? Okay, this is a case I haven't learned yet. Okay, let's... I believe that's... This one is L. Yeah, so... Okay. Um, R... U2 prime... R prime, U2, R prime, U prime, R, U prime, no. Wait, wait, how do you, okay, let's try this again. U2 prime, U2, U prime, U prime, R prime, U2, R, U2, R, U, R prime. Okay, I get it, I get it. That's so, that's so weird. Okay, so I guess you do it twice, or wait. If I hold it this way then. Okay. 
Okay, I, I messed it up again. But I'm getting it. I'm just not used to that. I'm used to like the regular 2 GLL. And that's the soon case that I don't know yet, or the anti soon case that I don't know yet, either way. Okay. YouTube, YouTube. YouTube, and then you insert. So, wait, no, no, no. Insert, and then you do one more time. So when you have these two facing outward, then you do this. Okay, that makes a lot of sense. I was, I was, that was a hard one. That was a tough one. But I got it in the end. And this looks to me, this next one looks kind of like... Okay, let's see. R, U prime... Oh wait. U prime, F, U, F prime... Wait, no. No, that's wrong. Or, I mean, I'm doing it wrong, not that the algorithm is called, but it's wrong. Yeah, I call that CO big L while the other, where the other one corner between the stickers is small L. Yeah, that makes sense. Um, okay, so what am I doing here that's weird? U prime, R prime, F prime, R U, R prime, U prime, R prime. Well, okay, that wasn't right, because I just swapped these three corners instead. Um, did I accident- I just accidentally did a soon case on orange. That's weird. <laughs> okay, let's just, um... Just fix orange real quick. Okay. Um, okay, R prime, U prime, R prime, F prime, sexy move, no, so that wasn't right either, I'm doing something weird, okay, first of all I want to solve this because I don't, I don't like having a white slot open while I'm solving the block. Um, okay. Awesome. Uh, okay. So we got that. Um, R prime, U prime, R prime, F prime. Oh, it's not sexy move, it's that one. Okay, okay, that, that actually makes a lot of sense. Okay, so. Okay, I think I, I think I kind of understand that one now. How to recognize it, I'm still kind of unsure. Okay. So 
This is... Is this the one we just did? Hang on. Okay, so they're opposite like that, and these two match up. Yeah, this is the one we just drilled. Easy, okay. Um, okay, now we have another one, which also looks pretty short. But these cases, despite these, the fact that these cases look easy, they look harder, they're, they're harder to recognize. F, U, R prime, U prime, R, F prime, insert. Okay, so basically, I see how you do this one. It's like the reverse of the other one. You do F, U, and then take the pair up, and then do F prime, and then insert it. Okay. Okay, now let's just uh, solve corners because like that. And then we'll um, move on to the uh, next one, which is small L. I guess there's fewer big L cases than small L. Or f fewer big L cases than the other ones, I meant to say. Okay, so R U prime R prime U two R prime U two R U Wait R U R prime U R U two R No 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 it was U two prime R U two R Okay And then we hold it like that Wait, no, 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 no. Wait, no, no, yeah, it was R, R prime U2. Wait, no, wait, what? Okay. Okay, so it's like this. Wait, no, okay. Okay, 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 I got it. I'm, I'm not looking at it, I'm not looking at it. Um, okay, I, I already did it wrong, I know that. Let's, you do U2, and then R prime U2, R, and then, hey, okay. Okay, I think I might learn the next two small L cases and then call it a day. Um, or maybe not. Wait, how long have we been streaming for? It was like one... Okay, it, it doesn't say beyond two hours. That That's unfortunate. Um, no, I'll, I'll learn the next two. It's fine. Um, okay, so this is, this looks like it's 2 gen. R, U, 2, wait, hold up. R, U, 2, R prime, U, oh no, no, R, 2 prime, U, wait, no, 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 no. Okay, U, 2, no, no, U, 2 prime, U, 2, U, U2, R prime, U2 prime, R prime. So I think this is like the inverse of the other one. Wait, no, 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 it doesn't start with an R2. Oh, 
Okay. Okay, I think I got it. Um, okay, so let's, once again, let's solve uh, the block so that way we can continue. And then, okay, corners ended up being solved. We could just do that, and then we have an A perm. I know that there's like a crazy alg I could do for A perm, but I don't remember. Like, like it's, it's like a, hang on, it's like this. But I never know what angle to do it from. And also, I don't know which A perm I use it for. Okay. Um, <clears throat> I know, I don't think that, that might not be the objectively optimal A perm, but I know that, uh, I know that Zoomer used it, like, like, ZZ Zoomer, or however you pronounce his name. I, I just say Zoomer in my head, but I don't know if there's a way that he pronounces it differently. Okay. Last algorithm of the day. R prime, U2, R prime, U2 prime. R, wait, no, I did something wrong. I must have, or not. Okay, no, I did something different this time. R, U2, R, U2 prime, no. I don't know what I did. What did I do? I did like a double J perm, what? <laughs> That's like the most, that was like the most useless Mega Minx alg ever, and I don't know how I did it. And now I have an N perm. Um, okay, uh. Okay. And I literally just learned this algorithm, but I forgot. Okay, I'm gonna like, I guess like close my eyes and try to remember it. Um, okay, I give up. <laughs> okay, I think that's a sign that we should stop. But, um, but first I need to remember what algorithm this was. Oh, it was this one. Uh, Okay, great. Okay, so we've been streaming for a while. I, I knocked out a good number of these elves. I, um, I think um, uh, tomorrow, well, tomorrow I'm not gonna be streaming because once again, I'm, I'm like moving to a location that looks exactly the same, but don't worry about it. Um, and yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed the stream. I think toward the end, I didn't really speak about much this time. Like I, I spoke about my solves and then I spoke briefly about D&D to like change up the topic. But I don't know. I don't know if you guys are not interested in that. And also, I guess what I'm getting at is today I reviewed a lot of Alex, So of course I wouldn't speak that much. But yeah, next stream... Whether that's in two days, three days, a week, I don't know when. Whenever that is, we're going to be finishing up these algs and we're going to be doing more Mega Mink solves. I hope you guys enjoyed and uh, take care of yourselves. See ya.